Hey everyone, LJ here, and today we are going to be announcing the winners of the Brickonicle contest that we hosted over on the message boards at board.ttvchannel.com. As you can see here, I have an envelope. It says the winners for the contest, and I will reveal the top three winners for our contest in just a moment. Thanks to all of you who entered our contest, there were so many fantastic entries. We really wish we could give awards to a great majority of you. Unfortunately, we really do not have the budget. As such, we do have our top three winners, but we also have a lot of honorable mentions for some fantastic entries that we just could not go without mentioning here. So let's go ahead and get started. In no particular order, here are our honorable mentions. Likora Raid by Plural. Kaita Team Warua vs. Teradax by Brick Pillar. Great Temple of Metnui by Cardax. Barag Cavern Battle by Velasha Jaktor. Tahu Master vs. Loss by Dark Nova 3529. Mana's Attack by Plural. 81930 Onokoro by Tora. Paraka Studio by Square. Galley vs. Tarakava by Alex22. Kininui Strike by Smeasel Diesel. Borak vs. Nuvak by Bricks of Awesome. Liwa's Jungle Speeder and City of the Mask Makers by CM Forsai. And Showdown in Lakoro by Mr. Joe Boto. Thank you all so much for entering. We really did have a tough time choosing these top three because there were so many fantastic entries that really did show us that System Bionicle could be a viable option. So once again, thank you all so very much. We are going to have a great time in future videos talking about all those wonderful entries. So without further ado, let's get to the top three. That's right, the winners for the contest. All right, here we go. Opening the, opening the envelope. Okay. All right, here we go. <clears throat> At third place, we have Nui Jaga Nest Battle by Reese E. There's no doubt in my mind that third place was the longest we spent debating any of these entries, but in the end, Nui Jaga Nest Battle won out. We really did love how he captured an iconic scene from Matt Nui Online game and translated it to a fun and exciting battle between Pohatu and a rather well-built Mixel Joint in Nui Jaga. Intermixed with its creative design, we see a play function that is fun for both family, friends, and those who are by themselves, as you can take a stone and catapult it into some pillars to defeat the evil Nui Jaga, just like in the game. Additionally, you can discover the evil plot Akmu has cooking with Makuta Teradax by exposing the infected Koli balls. We spent a great amount of time debating third place, and we're very glad and proud to say that you, Risa, have gotten third. Thank you very much for entering. Alright, next up we have second place. The second place winner is The Nui Rama Invade Lakoro by Aidy the Bukal. We spent a great deal of time also debating second place, and in the end, The Nui Rama Invade Lakoro happened to be our second place winner. The Nui Rama Invade Lakoro does an excellent job of showing exactly how detailed a Bionicle system set can get. Featuring two Nui Rama, several Matoran, and Toa Liwa, you can recreate one of the various battles Liwa is sure to have had with the Nui Rama. Showcasing a detailed and very well-made Likoro hut, hidden golden mask of levitation with a light-up brick behind it, and an excellent design concept for a Toa Liwa minifigure, this entry earns second place because it's an excellent example as to how well world building through a system medium can work. As while well, it's a large set and we see a large scale battle, it's a very small, personal, intimate part of Lakoro life as we can see a very well built hut hidden in the trees. Congratulations, AD the Bukal, for winning second place. We thank you very much for entering, and we look forward to talking about yours and many other entries on the podcast very soon. And finally, the first place winner goes to Attack on Takoro by Bricks of Awesome. While we're sure a lot of you saw this coming, Bricks of Awesome did a fantastic job of making a set that perfectly represents the gates of Takoro, with so many functions, including light up eyes, a working drawbridge, and a modular design. So if you get more than one, you can expand the walls of Takoro to possibly even make a full sized replica of the city itself. Attack on Takoro shows everything that System Bionicle could be capable of. 
excellent functions, a modular design, and plenty of world building and playability to boot. And that is why it has earned our number one spot in this contest. Congratulations Bricks of Awesome, and thank you all so much for entering this contest. We had a blast running it, and we really did enjoy seeing all the fantastic entries you guys made this time. We're looking forward to talking about a great majority of them on the podcast in the coming weeks. Once again, thank you so much for entering, and we hope you'll listen in and see what we think about everything else. I'm LJ, and thank you so much for watching. Congratulations to all, and I'll see you all next time. Farewell.